Hey there, everybody. I want to take a second and talk with you about lynda.com. Now, lynda.com is uh, included with your tuition at Parkland. So you actually have a active uh, lynda.com account. So I'm going to go to lynda.com right here. You may not be familiar with what lynda.com is. It is a resource for learning content. Um, meaning, if you are a developer or a designer in the web or photography or business or video or 3D animation, there are courses. And as a matter of fact, uh, there's 177 courses in on video tutorials and 3D animation. There's 316 courses. Well, if I clicked on that, um, it can show you all of these lectures that are out there that that have been created uh, with that particular topic. There are specific people who uh, make these videos. And what this does is this gives you a vast amount of additional resources. A lot of uh, several of the faculty, uh, instead of having you buy a textbook, we're actually utilizing a lot of these videos that are out there. So for instance, um, I'm interested in uh, uh, certain things and I can log in to lynda.com. I'll use my uh, organizational login. I'll use my email and then I'll create a unique password. And when I log in, I can begin to look at and build my own. Notice that I have a, 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 a little area here. I can go to my profile and look at that. I can go to my playlists. Now, I have begin, begin building playlists of things that I'm interested in. So first, uh, first uh, there are complete sections. One of them is a bootstrap for web design. This is a course in bootstrap. And it, it provides the entire course outline. Uh, it tells you that it's four hours and 55 minutes worth of material. It has uh, all of these are links to videos. It tells you how long each one of them are and sections according to uh, the topic. So working with Bootstrap Grid, here's all of the information I need to know. So I can look and see that I'm going to be, you know, I'm going to be watching about, well, I can see right there, I'm mean, about 40 minutes. I can understand all these core elements. Another area that I'm interested in, I can save that as a playlist. Um, I can look in different, uh, I can set up different playlists that, that, that are specific for class. So for instance, these, these uh, uh, video series, a series uh, fit with my particular course. I can add a, an entire course or just a specific video. So for instance, if I was interested in, um, let's say I wanted to learn about V-Ray, which is a, uh, uh, an, uh, a renderer for 3D animation, I can look up all these different people have written content or made a video talking about V-Ray. Some of them are specific for a, 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 an application. This is Rhino uh, or for Maya uh, or other things. It talks about installing. Uh, and so what I can do is I could, I could go to, let's say I wanted to learn this particular one right here. If I click on this, I can go, I can see the author. I can look at the different subjects and I can see uh, the different elements for what, uh, what's been uh, featured here. Uh, this is a five hour uh, video. These are the different topics that they talk about. And uh, so if I'm interested in this, uh, I, could, I could look it up. So I'm going to look over here. These are the different uh, work. This is the different videos. Uh, and I can actually get, if there's course information, I can actually download exercise files and those kind of things that go along with it. So I, I can go and I can see a, a, a video, an exercise, a, a welcome video that talks about what's going to be covered. And you can hear from the, the direct, the, the maker of the film. Then I have all the videos here. Now what's nice is if I can add this, I could add this to a playlist. So I go up here and I can say add to, I can make a new playlist. 
or I could add to a playlist that already exists. So if I wanted to, I could add it to one of mine. I use a little, I'm going to make a playlist and say V-Ray. So I could then choose only the video that I have selected, which would be this welcome video, or I could add the whole course. So if I add the whole course, so I could choose video only or course, I could create, and then whenever I look at my playlist, I've got one here that I can then uh, I can choose as I go back. So what's nice is you can choose any kind of topic. Let me see. I'm interested in After Effects Puppet, the Puppet tool. Let's see if it has anything. Uh, so this is using the Puppet tool in After Effects. So this is something I'd be interested in. I could go to this uh, and learn about that specific course and learn... And I can also look at a specific uh, author, like this author is George Maestri. I watched a lot of his videos, and I can see other things that he's produced. And so I can learn a lot. So if you happen to know a sp or have a specific uh, person in mind, I don't know, let's see, Don Bluth, let's see if he made any uh, videos. Uh, look, this person here is related somehow. Now, he might not be, but he studied under Don Bluth. And so uh, that's one of the things that's interesting uh, that you'll find uh, that you might be able to find someone who might be uh, a, a student or uh, uh, something like that. So uh, you may find a lot of interesting things here. So searching through this is a great tool. Now, how do you get it? You need to go to the Parkland, myparkland.com webpage. And when you log in, you'll go to this page. And over here in your knowledge base, you click on that. And it will follow you how, and the first thing is, how do I access lynda.com? And it will give you the steps and how you can do that. If you have problems, you'll want to go and talk to the Parkland help desk. So you might want to talk with them and uh, make sure you get it going. Because you will be using this in the future for lots and lots of things. All right, so hopefully you will go and you will be searching out and utilizing lynda.com. It's a really great resource. We're fortunate to have it with our Parkland tuition, and uh, I hope you utilize it to the fullest while you have access to it.